Hey everybody, I'm here today to talk to you about a drill versus an impact driver. In this video, I will be talking about the main differences between the two tools and I will also be talking to you about some of the benefits of using each of these tools. Let's get right to it. This is a drill. This is an impact driver. As you can see, the drill is significantly bigger than the impact driver and the drill is also significantly heavier than the impact driver. Now, if you take a look at this drill right here, you can see that it has multiple speed settings. It has a speed setting of one and two. With the speed setting of one, it goes slower than the speed setting of two, just as you can see. An impact driver doesn't have speed settings, okay? Now, I'm just gonna switch it to the lower speed once again. In addition to the speed settings, this drill, or, or I should say drills, also have adjustable clutches. This is a clutch right here. You can adjust the clutch, and the clutch will stop the drill from drilling once it reaches a certain threshold. So I'm actually just going to be pressing the button and drilling, and then I'm gonna grab on to the chuck of the drill, and you'll see that it will stop drilling because of the pressure, okay? Let's get right to it. You can watch this, just as you can see right there. So you see the drill stops drilling because of the clutch control. An impact driver, doesn't have an adjustable clutch like a drill, okay? Now, basically, if you look at the front end of the drill, you can see the chuck here, okay? It is designed to hold multiple types of bits, okay? So right now, it has a hex bit inside of it. I'm just gonna actually bring this clutch up. I'm actually just going to uh, remove that hex bit, just like that. So it has a hex bit inside of it, but the chuck of the drill can also hold other types of bits, just like this one that has a smooth side right here, that has a smooth base, okay? It can, hold, it can hold other types of bits, just like that. So it's very versatile with regards to the bits that it can hold. An impact driver has a special type of collet right here, okay? So it only holds hex bits, okay? And they can be easily loaded and unloaded, just like that, okay? Really quick to unload and load up, just like that. Now, basically, an impact driver is designed to do one job and one job only, and that is to drive screws. If you are going to be driving a lot of screws or you need a lot of power, then an impact driver is what you need because an impact driver has significantly more power than a drill, okay? Significantly more power than a drill. So an impact driver is designed to drive screws and to drive them hard. A drill is designed to, it's designed to be more versatile. So basically it can hold different types of bits and it's designed to do many things. Drive screws, drill pilot holes. Let's say I wanted to drill into a concrete wall. I could, you know, attach this bit and drill into a concrete wall. Um, it's designed to do many different things. Whereas an impact driver is designed to do one thing and one thing only and that is to drive screws. You can see that it does it really quickly and, and it has a ton of power a ton of power and it's also you know more lightweight so it's designed it has one job and one job only whereas the drill is designed to be more versatile okay and offer a few different features that the impact driver does not have that's basically it in this video i've spoken to you about some of the main differences and main jobs of a drill and an impact driver and that's basically it i hope that you have enjoyed this video and that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.